mama, I dedicate this song to you. Wherever you day, my mama, I just want to say thank you. Our oh mama, I just sing this song for you. Wherever you day, my mama, I just want to say thank you. For the things you they do for me, for the blessings you rain on me. Sometimes I lose my way, but you still the pray for me, the sacrifice for me. Oh yeah, yeah, mama. Now, happy Mother's Day. Um, <laughs> look, one of my, the fondest memories of my mother, or if anybody knows my mother, you know she's a, a stickler for discipline. So one of my fondest memories was when a cousin of mine, an older cousin of mine, you know, went to school, yes, his, uh, insulted a teacher of his. And then over the weekend, my mom got to hear about it. Now, there wasn't any real punishment uh, meted out to my cousin. So the following Monday, unannounced, my mom appears in school at assembly and demands that he be punished in front of the whole school. They lash my cousin, and then my mom takes the key and lashes him herself. I was like, hey, mom, you know what am I? This was crazy. Like, you, you, you couldn't do certain things and, and get out of here. Consequently, you know, me who lived with her, I was a very obedient child always, so yeah. Thank you, Mom, for the for the discipline. Um, and also, I, I think there's something that, while she was a strict disciplinarian, uh, she was also very nurturing and always very thoughtful and empathetic. What others? So, there was a time she was scheduled for a very serious operation. Yeah, a hysterectomy. And, you know, my mom and I are close. We talk about almost everything. Well, at least that's what I thought. So I was in secondary school and uh, well, usually she'd come and visit me over the weekends and stuff like that. My mother. Yes, I accept. But I missed her for a couple of weeks. Unbeknownst to me, she had gone, gone to do the operation, spend time recovering in the hospital, and only told me afterwards when I came home for vacation. So initially I was like, why didn't you tell me? Look at me, like, like I'm a doctor, like I, I, I could do something about it. But the reason was that she didn't want any emotional trouble from me. Knowing how close I was to her, how sensitive I was at the time, she decided to save me the stress and only told me after when it was successful. Needless to say, I, 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 was, I was really mad at her. But you know, maturity has a, a way of opening things up to you. And so in hindsight, I'm really grateful for that uh, act on her part. Yes, it, it was a serious operation. Da, da, da. I don't think I would have spent my time being calm as I was um, during that period in school. So yes, I think uh, those are two things that I remember fondly uh, of, my, of my mom, the disciplinarian, but the thoughtful, loving and caring one. Thank you for everything you've done for me. Happy Mother's Day once again. Hello, Mom. So I remember when I was young, a teenager, I had completed junior high school, fresh. Then I saw this development in my book. That was a good. I was seeing that um, a part of my neck was swollen. So I told my mom about it. And I realized that since I told her she was never herself, every day instead of going to work, she would take me to one specialist or the other. Sometimes we ended up at prayer camps just so she sees that that goes is no more there. She, she went anywhere, she used all her money. Eventually, I, I ended up in the hospital and then they performed a surgery before she she was taught life back to herself and I felt that moment was I don't know how to say it but it was the best sacrifice a mother to look into 
her child. And after the surgery, I saw that happiness restored in the back of her life. And then recently, um, I, I learned driving not long ago, that would be two years ago. And then I visited them in the house. My brother, my younger brother then was also learning to drive. So he took my daddy's car to go grind fufu at the fufu machine. And then he slammed the car and dented a part of it. My mother, my mother knowing who my dad was and how furious we'd be seeing the car in that state, decided to say that, well, it's me, actually. <laughs> Who, because I had learned driving no long ago, so it was me that decided to use his vehicle for that and that. It happens with, with new drivers, amateur drivers, so he should just let it go. And that was how he saved my brother from my father's wrath. And all these moments are things that when I think of, I really admire my mom for. She's, she's been there for all of us, and I don't take that for granted. Thank you, mom. Happy Mother's Day to 